Hey, what's going on? You know who it is. You know what it is. All right, man. Man, shout out to the homie BO9263, man. He keep these scoops coming up, man. He's scooping everybody, but that's good, man. That's what we do, man. You know, we put something out, and then, you know, we follow behind, you know, all in unison because we all on the same page when it comes to certain things. Most of us, is we all on the same page when it comes to uh, preserving and saving, you know, and helping out the black youth. You know what I'm saying? Because at the end of the day, our children are the future. You know what I'm saying? Real talk. But uh, go subscribe to his channel once again, BO9263. Uh, man, shout out to the brother, man. He put out a, uh, a video in regards of Kareem Abdul-Jabbar, like I said, the real GOAT. You know, the real greatest player of all time. You know, on the court and outside of the court. You know, basically, he issued the same statement that I've been issuing, calling out the NFL players. Basically saying they need to stand behind Colin Kaepernick. This is what I've been saying about the power of the NFL players. They should know and realize how much power they have. At the end of the day, you know, fuck what the media think. You know what I'm saying? You got to let the coons be. You know, all these motherfuckers like, you know, Ray Lewis... You know, Herm Edwards, you know, Cordell Stewart, all the, you know, Michael Vick, all them people that's talking that bullshit about Colin Kaepernick. Fuck them. Fuck them niggas, man. Straight up. But I got to say something in regards to what Kareem Abdul Jabbar is doing. I'm going to have to say other players from other leagues need to call out the owners in the NFL for how they're treating Colin Kaepernick. Because at the end of the day, we should hold everybody responsible. Whether you play in the NFL or not. If you're a black athlete, you need to be called out. And that includes motherfuckers in the NBA. Yes, that includes Stephen Curry, LeBron James, Dwayne Wade. Hell, MJ, all these people. If Kareem can speak out, then why can't other people speak out? Because to me, Kareem Abdul-Jabbar didn't put these other dudes on notice. Let's just face the fact, most people, most real basketball experts, if you ask who's the greatest basketball player of all time, it's either going to be Kareem or, Ma or MJ, number 23, 33 or 23. If you ask who's the greatest player of all time. But man, once again, shout out to Kareem, man. Real talk, man. He out there fighting the fight. And it's a shame that Kareem, a dude who's, uh, if I'm not mistaken, Kareem is 71 years old, if I'm not mistaken. 70, 71. And he got more guts than a bunch of 20-something-year-olds, a bunch of 30-something-year-olds, a bunch of 40-something-year-olds. See, that's what you call some real OG shit. You know what I'm saying? But once again... You, you you should expect this out of Kareem because, once again, Kareem was one of the real brothers that was out there fighting a the good fight. I'm talking about in the 60s. Kareem Abdul-Jabbar put his life and his reputation on the line, you know, to help the advancement of black people. He literally put his life on the line for us. So, it is what it is, man. And shout out to Kareem Abdul-Jabbar, man, for basically calling everybody out and put e everybody on notice. Yes, the NBA players should be called out, too. I'm a Golden State Warrior fan. I'm a Steph Curry fan, but I got to hold all these dudes accountable. Not just LeBron James, because I know people going, no, I'm not going to put this on LeBron James. I'm putting this on everybody. You know, Charles Barkley and Shaquille O'Neal had something negative to say about Colin Kaepernick, but where's the dudes that got something positive? Why don't the dudes that's currently in the NBA, the superstars, say, hey, we think Colin Kaepernick should get another job in the NFL? I guarantee you if all these players stuck together in unison, they could shut these owners down. They could shut these white supremacists down. They could shut these scary-ass, coward-ass coons down. And then they can shut these on-the-fence clowns down, too. So, 
It is what it is. Once again, shout out to Kareem Abdul-Jabbar.